I am Anil Kumar. Welcome to my series on finding area and perimeter. In this particular question, we have a composite figure. We have a trapezoid in which there is a semicircle. So, semicircle has been taken away. The question here is, calculate area of the shaded region in the isosceles trapezoid with a semicircle as shown in the figure below. You can always pause the video, answer this question, and then look into my suggestions. Now, two formulas which you need to remember to find the area is uh, area of a circle is pi r square and area of trapezoid is e plus b times height over 2 uh, where a and b are lengths of the parallel side so if we have a trapezoid it may be isosceles it may not be isosceles so a and b are these two sides which are parallel basically and height is the distance between them then that becomes the area of the trapezoid Knowing this, it should be simple enough to calculate the area of the shaded portion. I would like you to pause the video now, calculate the answer, and then look into my suggestions. Now, to find the area very clearly, we have to find the area of the trapezoid and take away area of semicircle, right? So, so we have area of shaded portion. as equal to area of trapezoid minus area of semicircle correct so area of trapezoid how do we figure this out we need to still find the height so first exercise is to find the height now how do we find height so, since this is like isosceles, these two sides are equal. So there is symmetry in this, right? So, so that could be the radius of this circle. We are given 8 centimeters. So these two sides are equal. That means this is 4 and that is also 4. That means the radius is equal to 4. So in our case, we can write that AB as we are saying here, we can say a equals to 8 b equals to 14 and h equals to 4 so we get the area for trapezoid and we know the radius r is also equal to 4 so using these we can always find the area of the portion good so let's use these values so area of the trapezoid in this case is going to be um, We'll use this formula. So 8 plus 14 times 4 divided by 2, right? So we have used this particular formula. A plus B times height divided by 2 minus area of semicircle. Semicircle means pi times R square. R is 4 <coughs> divided by 2. Semicircle means half circle. So, so we have to divide the circle area by 2, right? So that is to say that area of circle is this much. So area of semicircle equals to pi r square divided by 2. So we did this here, correct? So that is how you're going to find it. Now we can just calculate the, the answer, right? So if you do simple calculations here, we get 8 plus 4 as 12 to 1. So 8 plus 14 is 22. We are going to multiply this by 2. And then pi r square, 14 squared is 16 divided by 2 is 8 minus 8 pi. So that gives you the answer. And the units will be centimeters squared. Is it clear to you? Let's use calculator. So we have... Uh, 22 times 2 minus 8 times 
and the answer in decimals is 18.88 centimeters square. We can say approximately 19 centimeters square. Is it clear? So that is how we could actually do it. If calculator is not allowed, you may just estimate the value. This is 44 and multiply this by 3, right? 44 take away around 24 will give you 20 centimeters square approximately as an estimate, right? So I hope these steps are absolutely clear. Feel free to write your comment, share your views. And if you like and subscribe to my videos, that'd be great. Thanks for watching and all the best.